Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check the RAM memory on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, the first thing you can do is hop into your settings on your iPhone here, and we can just scroll down and tap on general. Now, at the very top, we're gonna to choose about. Now, you'll be able to see here the capacity, 128 gigabytes for this iPhone 14 Pro, but it doesn't show us what the RAM or the memory for this iPhone. For some reason, Apple decided not to put that in the about info. However, we can find that information out by scrolling down and we're gonna copy this IMEI number. So tap and hold and hit copy. Now, after we've done that, we're just gonna open up a web browser. So open a web browser and just type in IMEI lookup. You can use a bunch of different ones, but let's use this IMEI info. Now that we're in here, it just says to paste in your IMEI number. So I'm gonna paste it in. For some reason, it has not been capturing the last couple digits, so it is 8418. I'm gonna have to type in the last two digits, and I can tap I'm a human, and hit check. This will check a bunch of different things for your specific phone. So you can see iPhone 14 Pro, the, bot, the brand, the model number, the IMEI, I can scroll down and now it says basically when it was released, the SIM card, LTE, the dimensions. Now let's tap expand here and keep scrolling down and you'll be able to see built-in memory is 128 gigabytes and RAM memory, finally we get to it, is six gigabytes here. So you'll be able to see it is six gigabytes. So ultimately you need to go through this entire process to be able to see it. But unlike other devices, Apple does a really good job of managing the RAM on your iPhone. So you don't really need to clear that uh, RAM memory or you don't need to wipe it out or you really don't even need to close out of apps. It does a really good job of juggling around that memory so that you can do exactly what you wanna do on your phone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.